me pongo? ¿Para qué me invita? ¿Para qué me invita? What's up, you scumbags? Welcome to another episode of Scum and Kick It, the podcast your mom warned you about. It's me, Scumbags, with my homie XG. What's up, what's up, what's up? You know what number it is? Mmm, shit, I don't even 24, remember. 24, dog, 24, 7. Damn, Kobe? No, Kobe, yeah, Kobe, right? That's Kobe, yeah, yeah, man. yeah. Also Kobe. You but still do that? You still, like, you still, like, whenever you, like, shoot, you show. Oh, uh, yeah, come on, you, you gotta do that when you throw fucking trash. Okay. <laughs> you? Hmm? You? When you're shooting your shot, the chick's like, Kobe. Kobe. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty homo, dog. It's pretty homo if that's how you end your cum shot. Kobe. 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 <laughs> bro, that's why. Bro, that'd be hard. It's pretty hard, though. The bitch is like, Kobe. <laughs> bro. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, anyways, guys, you guys know what to do. Go ask your bitch to get you a beer. Should we call her a bitch yet or no? You already did, dog. You already did. Right. No, tell, yeah. tell, tell that bitch to go get you a beer. You got your beer? Yep. All right, man. Pop it open. Cheer with the homie. Now we got to kick her out because we haven't been kicking these bitches out, dog. Yeah. She's been staying in the room the whole time. You, you think any of them sneak in? Or you think any of them, like, some pendejas, like, they fall asleep? <laughs> they fall asleep. The they're sleep? like, oh, it's Wednesday night. <laughs> this gun's about to go on. And they're like, let me, like. At 6.45, they're already on the bed, on the, on the sofa. <laughs> And then like you you can't kick her out if she's sleeping like you can't be that much of a scumbag. Nah, you know? kick her out. Fuck that. Wake the fuck up, girl. <laughs> she's on the couch right now. You know you hear this. Wake up right now. Get the fuck out of here. But do you watch? Do it up. Do you watch this in the living room? Like Ooh. if you have a family, you watching this in the living room? Like full screen, sound surround, surround <laughs> system, <laughs> surround like the morritos <laughs> running around. They know us. Oh, that's nah, Munir. That's my uncle Munir. <laughs> <laughs> that's Unc. <laughs> <laughs> nah, you think this is a garage podcast? Yeah, it's a garage. A gar- garage. This, this is a game. Yeah, man cave. Maybe headphones on. On in- maybe phone in the car. When you're cheating on your on your wife, you can play this. Because <laughs> the, the Sancha knows, dog. The Sancha knows hey, the don't, get down. Don't she be probably hears that. Yeah. She go, wait, bro. Oh, sh- 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 we hey, don't bro. cheat on you. We don't cheat <laughs> over here. Shh, <laughs> sh- sh- bitch. Go back real, to sleep. Real men don't cheat. <laughs> <laughs> What's uh what's uh twinkle twinkle little star <laughs> <laughs> put that bitch back to sleep dog she gonna just get annoyed and just walk on her own now like this show's annoying I don't know why you watch this shit hey but I've been getting a lot of reviews from chicks to be honest a lot of chicks tell me hey I watch this come and kick it and I'm like damn we have a female audience bro there's I think they're watching to get caught up on game you're right they're like, they're like, dude, I got to hear the scummiest of the scum. <laughs> <laughs> so whatever I get is not as bad as these motherfuckers. <laughs> no, I know how to deal with their man. How huh? like, okay, right? that's, how, that's how they really think? Yeah. No wonder he always tells me to go get lunch or, or, or go to the movies on Wednesday night. <laughs> no wonder he always comes home smiling like pussy. <laughs> so anyways, what did you do this week or... No, well, dog. Well, what are you talking about? I can't get. I can't stop getting DMs asking me, dog. What happened at the fucking scum and kick it studio? Oh man, luckily the wall, bro. I thought they were gonna break the wall, man. Go went like when that shit went down. Oh. But anyway, tell them what what, what they've been DMing you about. So I don't know if you guys know, we kind of went viral. Not us, the studio. Sounds the, weird, that, but we can't, we can't studio, go viral. Yeah, <laughs> dog. I, I, we fucking the <laughs> studio went viral. Uh, <laughs> the studio, the studio's famous and not us. Everyone kept t- texting me like, "That's your guys' studio, right?" Like, <laughs> at, at least someone's going viral, yeah, right? There. <laughs> like, fuck. so no, uh, we podcasted last Monday night, and then uh, we were chilling buzzing i'm about to dip out and then the scum's like dude the yodi's about to come over they asked me to rent out the studio type of shit i'm like i thought you only rent this shit out to only fans <laughs> no, that, that's free <laughs> that's free <laughs> <laughs> so i'm being your typical fucking groupie of the year i'm being the groupie of the year i'm like dog i'm, I'm gonna stay i'm gonna kick it so i got a couple it's come and kick it after hours yeah, it's come and kick it after hours we kick it the yodi's pull up and they had like a I mean, explain it, cause I, I at first I thought it was fake, and then the shit wasn't fake, and then. Man, well, they, it's cause they pulled up with their homie, I guess. Well, it was their homie, not anymore. But they're like, hey, let us film a podcast. There, I was like, oh, it's gonna kick it. They're like, no, that's gonna kick it. I'm like, <laughs> yeah. oh. All right, Yodi, thank you, Yodi. 
<laughs> Are you gonna at least wear a little bit of our gear? <laughs> yeah, I had to force him to wear a hat. I was like, I just threw it and it landed on that fool's head. <laughs> and then I was like, man, I gotta get something out of this shit. But whatever, these fools were filming and shit, and then it was like 30 minutes in the thing, and they were getting heated, bro. This guy was asking like some racist ass questions and shit, bro. Like, like why do they make rap and all this shit? And they were just getting pissed off. And then that fool said the N-word. I mean, not the N-word, the hard R. You know what the hard R is? Retard? Well, that one too, but not, not retard. Oh, hard E-R. Yeah. Yeah, the, bro, it's the, different. The, hard, the, the hard, hard word. The hard R. <laughs> yeah, hard R is hard, it's hard retard. Like, you're not allowed to say retard. <laughs> 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 All right, well, well, what, yeah, the E-R. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What is I it? I won't say that one. The, the hard R, you could say it. I'm super lost. Retard, right? <sighs> Fucking retard. What's the hard R? Beaner. Oh, Beaner. <laughs> yeah, I'm what the fuck? Wait, <laughs> what? <laughs> what? That's the, it's like saying the N word, but for Latinos, I've no? I've never said anyone say, like, oh, don't say the hard R. No one ever called you a Beaner and you got offended? I do. That's not, that's the least offensive thing in the world. Nah. Like, I don't, no. Nah, really. You don't even eat beans, huh? It just doesn't offend me. Like, what? It's just, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. No one ever whipped me and they said, go Wait, over there. Wait, okay, somebody from another race. Beaner? <laughs> <laughs> I understand why they don't like it. I understand why. Yeah, I just, no one ever was like, said that to us. Like, wetback hurts. Wetback hurts because wetback makes sense. We crossed the river. I understand that. When people say beaner, they're like, what? Huh? Because I like beans. Like, at the end of the day, like. Well, it's not because you, like, it just, beaner just sounds like you're a bean. Like, what if I don't eat beans? And then you're a then you're missing a lot of fucking good source of protein. I don't know what the <laughs> fuck's going on here. I don't understand. Wetback, <laughs> wetback sucks, dog. Like a so wetback. Uh, to me, it's the same. They call me a wetback. Well, I'm Cuban, so they, they always say like the banana boat. Like you came in a banana boat, and I guess it could be a wetback too, right? Cause yeah. Uh, apparently, there's waves, so I'm pretty sure the some water's gonna splash on my back. I'm on a boat. I don't know, dude. My my back's. Not as wet anymore. It's a little damp. I've been here for a while, dog. It's a little damp. You know, it's, no, it's no, one, no one's you're always, that, always at rave. You're always at rave with the shirt off and getting that wet, wet back soaking, fucking dry. <laughs> All right, so they said the hard, the hard R. Yeah, they said the hard Damn, R. And the hard R. Fucking. <laughs> <laughs> Those fools got pissed, bro. So they started fucking that fool up. To it. About, I mean, you, you know, think white what, suburban what, kids was what, related to Kodak Black? You think they were related to N.W.A. when they came out? Okay. It doesn't matter. It's somebody speaking. But y'all not N.W.A. Y'all not that. We're M.W.A. We're a hip hop. We're M.W.A. We're from an authentic place. We're being real, bro. Y'all make like fucking like Beaner music. Hey, boy. Hey, Beaner music. And then I was like, oh, not the fucking studio, bro. They're going to fucking break this shit. You know, we, we got to use it for another episode. Like, we're already being consistent. Now, we're not going to be consistent with a broken studio. But, uh, yeah, they were beating his ass, bro. And that shit went pretty viral, man. Because people were tagging me on that shit. Like, hey, isn't that the studio? And I was like, yeah. They are like, is that fake? Or no, it was real, bro. That shit. Fool fucking pushed the limits with the hard R player. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> See, so if they would have called you a beaner, you would have just started laughing like, <laughs> all right. Or what, what would you have done if they called you a beaner? I made a podcast, like some fool's interviewing you, and he's like, all right, you, you only, you I don't know, the only moment is only for beaners. The like, only oh, moment in time oh. that I would react to anything is you basically got to touch me. Damn, all right. That whole word, I mean, dude, you're the first one. You're assaulting them first. Well, they flipped his hat. Did you see the hat? See, that's what I mean. That's more than that's more than Beaner. What would he have done right there with the hat? Yeah, flip? once you touch someone, yeah, it's pretty much on site uh, with anybody. Imagine if you were going bald and they flipped the hat and you're just like, oh fuck, fuck dog, I haven't been trying to show this shit. Oh man. <laughs> We gotta hit up hims.com. Use promo code Tinfall Hat if you wanna use hims.com for your health for your fucking your CD hairline. <laughs> you think we have bald fans? <laughs> no, like, yeah, but we should fucking start selling hats. We're fucking up. Uh, uh, well, it's up. almost beanie season. We'll cover that cabeza up. Oh, but no, that shit was dope. We went viral. Even George Perez hit me up. Dog, yeah, what's up? He wanted to fight, huh? Dude, he wanted to be a guest all of a sudden. Yeah, shit. <laughs> Who just wants to come and fight? Probably like, fuck it. I heard that's gonna kick a fight there. <laughs> like what? I know I thought I was reading the comment had to be real big boy Shaq well they, they told me uh Coyote was telling me that Shaq called them. Like hey what's going on over there? What happened? Why is that for being racist? And be be real 
And a few, a few other people started calling them, like, is everything good? You guys need backup? Like, damn, they were going to fuck up that podcaster, dude. Um, so don't, I guess don't call people Beaner. Don't call people Beaner. So do you know who should have hit him us up to back us up? Who? Oscar De Loya and the little Tanguita comes in, pulling up, dog. What's up, fool? You guys it, fucking anti-beaters? He's been going crazy lately, dog. <laughs> I know you love it. You send it to the... <laughs> you're like, yo, this one's a good one, dog. And I and just I, see fucking Oscar going ham. The Dana, the Dana White one was fun. Like, hey, I'm going to see you, Dana White. And they start shadow boxing. Like, what is wrong with this fool? Bro, I mean, I know the answer is yeah, but... Would you do a whole weekend with them? You think you can hang a whole weekend with Oscar De Loya? Like, Man, that's a lot of coke. Co- yeah, everything though, bro. He's not gonna let you hang out with them without doing blow. As, as long as I don't have to wear, I'll do coke. As no long as I no tanga. No tanguita. What is, would you kick it if he's? Would you kick it if? He, oh no. In his penthouse, if he's walking around in the tanga, there's other bitches there. Oh, there's other bitches. Oh, cool. Fuck but it. he's walking around. He's coming up to you. As like, long as he's not twerking. He, he's coming up to you. He's like, what's up, scumbag? <laughs> Imagine and he's start, fucking he shadow boxing you and he's like, what's up, fool? <laughs> he starts throwing the, the Mayweather, but starts throwing the butt. <laughs> like, like, oh, come on. Oscar. Are you leaving? Are you staying? Because I know you don't like that. <laughs> 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 like, fuck. If, there, if there's bitches there, I'll stay like, hey, relax, Oscar, relax. relax. And then you can't get him drunk where he'll pass out because he's hot coked out. So he's, he's only yeah, going to get up. wild, yeah. He's only going to stay up more and more, so. Now nah, I'm pretty sure he, like bomb ass bitches would pull up to that fool's mansion. A penthouse shit. No, he has a big ass mansion in Vegas. Yeah. Yeah, that fool's like a big ass dope view. Dick, he's rich as fuck, bro. That fool's fucking rich. That's better than a penthouse, though. Maybe you see the house. Yeah, he has, he has like a little golfing. He has a a, a room with a yeah, bar a and a golf. house is a penthouse for the night. Like I get what you mean, Bobby Beer, Bobby Beer. Yeah, obviously a bench is the best place. But I'm talking penthouse. When you, to, like, I don't know, for a couple of times I've been to the penthouse in Vegas, all the way to the top. You know? I'm sure he has something, no? It, It'll be tight. Isn't the I think the Golden Boy um, office is right here at the U.S. Bank building, no? You ever been? I mean, you kick it more in downtown LA. I really don't. You been some some, some sick ass penthouse down here? Like yeah, somewhere you're like, whoa, no mames. This can you, like, what? How much is the rent? You don't even want to know type of shit. Like, I, I, like, I went to one because the homie was like, we have to go kick it with one of my friends in the apartments right here down the street. And then he's all like, hey, there's a poker night upstairs in the penthouse. What was the buy-in? Do you remember? <laughs> no, I'm a fucking fiend. I'm a gambling <laughs> fiend. <dog. laughs> like, he should know. This, this, like, this is the, the first thing he asked. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I asked him first? What? <laughs> So you're gonna ask hey, how much of the buying? Yo, how, uh, how many bitches are there? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Is there you bitches? You said poker, dog. Well, I'm not trying to watch the food play poker. Money. I'm trying to make. I'm trying to play. I'm trying to sit at that table. Man, I'm, I'm trying, trying to, to take all their money. All these little fishes right here. I'm a shark. Hell really. no. A poker night. <laughs> Man, I'm trying to watch some food play cards. What the fuck? <laughs> no one's telling you to watch. It's called participate. I don't know how to play poker. That's different then. That's <laughs> different. I get all that. I get that part of the fucking equation. All right, all right. So I asked, is there going to be bitches, right? And you know what he said? They're strippers. Oh, yeah. It's a private game. Yeah, yeah. There's at least a $1,000 buy-in. Easy. So, so we, we go. Well, he, luckily he knew the promoter that was throwing it. We go up there. Big ass fucking penthouse suite. Fucking it had like the, the balcony had a, a jacuzzi and everything. So we get in there, and there's a stripper pole. There's strippers dancing. There's people passing out coke, alcohol, all this shit. Like, oh, that's like, all free. Yeah, it's yeah, all free. It's all free. Like you already paid. Like you already, you already participating in the game. You're already dropping enough money where you're like, oh, it's all free. It's just like a, it's an add-on. Yeah, so I go in there, and I'm like, damn, I've never been to this shit. This is dope. And there, there's people gambling and shit, but I'll just look at the bitches. Next thing you know, so those uh, bitches are the people who gamble. Just so you know. <laughs> just saying, dog. You're no, getting the benefits I, without participating. Like, yeah, I, the I, reason I, people <laughs> sit there because they give money. You're like, then I saw here. You lost a thousand bucks. Let's eat. Well, get, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Get, let's, get your dick sucked. Let, let's, for, <laughs> let's 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 let you forget that you just lost ten racks here, dog. It's come back to them like, yo, suck my dick, bitch. I, I, I was. I look. Let me bring the story. <laughs> I'm in there playing it cool, like, oh, bitch is cool, and then uh, we go to the bathroom. Me. Two of the homies to roll, to smoke, right? We're smoking. I don't know how I got cocaine, but oh yeah, the homie had cocaine. So I started doing coke. Bitches were going to the to the bathroom with us, like, oh you guys have coke? Like boom, started giving them key shots. I started getting one started making out with her. And I'm like, what the fuck? She's like, oh my and my boyfriend finds out he's gonna get so pissed. He's, he's sitting in the table gambling and I'm making out with oh, her. That was me, dog. That was your bitch? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> fuck. 
I remember playing no, poker. No wonder she tastes like fucking backwoods. <laughs> Back, she's like back with an ecstasy, bro. So you're hooking up with someone that's at the fucking table, dog. Yeah, we're, we're making uh, the homies are in the back. That was a baller. That was by a major baller. That was at the table. That could have paid to got me killed right there. <laughs> so I was like, I was making out there, fucking sucking titty in front of the homies right there, because it was just that bathroom was already getting wild. She's like, my boyfriend gonna get mad if he finds out. I'm like, oh, where's he at? He's out. He's right there playing poker. I was like. Damn, this bitch is risky, you know? It's gonna get me. Uh, then I started She's a out. gambler. She's yeah. like her she's like her man dog. She, she's like her man. She, you think put she, it all, she put it all on black. You think she paid a dollar to get in? Yeah, she put on that BBC. <laughs> <laughs> no, BWC. Big white cog, no, Latino cog. Latino cog. <laughs> BLC is now. Oh, a B uh a make BBW. It, make, uh, make it let us cheese. No, beaner. <laughs> What's the beaner one? Beaner <laughs> Big no. Black Yeah, big Big Beaner Cog. Yeah, Big Beaner. Yeah, <laughs> exactly, dude. You can use BBC with fucking Beaners, too, if you're oh, willing yeah, to use true, the... Yeah. Right? If you're so willing to use the... If you're right. willing to use the, the R, the hard R. She w- <laughs> no wonder she walked in like, hey, I'm looking for a BBC. I was like, oh, well, we didn't bring the black homie. I was like, no, I'm looking for a Beaner, <laughs> Big Cog <laughs> Beaner. <laughs> no, so girl, I'm sucking that bitch's titties. But the homie's right there doing coke. And after that, so the coke hit, and now I'm paranoid, like, oh, her man's here? Is she, like, am I going to get set up and get killed right here? Because, you know, the poker thing, it's just like, sh- there's no rules in there, so I'm like, fuck, I'm probably going to get shot today, you know? But in your defense, I sat the poker, at the poker table for hours, dude. It's a, it's a, it's a long-term game. Like, you could have yeah. fucked her, like, four times in that four. If he was he running good. He wouldn't have anyway. If he was running good, though, he would have not fucking known it. When you're playing, it's all, like... There's like a lot, dude. There's a lot of money on the table. You can't be thinking about if your lady's cheating on you. Yeah, <laughs> your lady cheating on you ten feet away. Yeah. <laughs> Boy, you're busy. There's money on the table. You can't be wondering like, is my girl sucking a cock or should I call all in right now? <laughs> should I go to the bathroom? Yeah. Bro? You think that fool was like looking at the car like, is that my girl's pussy? <laughs> <laughs> smells like my girlfriend's pussy. But uh, it's cool because we ended up. Still being friends after me and that girl and they're fucking her later. Yeah, but yeah, ra- random, huh? But shout out to you though. So shout out to the poker shout club. Shout out to you for Pick fucking. Up on bitch at that poker club. Don't, don't hit on my lady at the poker club. <laughs> 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 so no go to the we- poker club, guys. There's bitches there that are down to rest their life <laughs> and yours. I'm in a club trying to find me the baddest bitch. Best friends, but I don't know which one to pick uh, I'm in that scumbag drip, look at the fit Bitches seen okay, and you know that I never miss I think the cat calling me, I hear a hiss You see me counting money, none of your biz Stop playing games, this is not a Nintendo Switch I'm a whole ass joint, the whole team stay lit Fuck with us and you gon' see what I hype about I'm just tryna see the ends be up in my account They be hating from your city, fuck is that about? But I don't let it get to me, I just laugh aloud Hey, let me see you dance, shake that ass, girl Fuck it up, make it nasty for these bands, girl VIP, that's just how we like to do it Yeah, I'm a scumbag for real shit They be like they hella different, don't know who to be Like cut it out with all the bullshit and the foolery I'm first in line, shout out everyone that's after me And every time I hit the booth, I make a masterpiece Touch, Touching dirty money, call it scumbagging He looks stupid, tryna flex, I guess he done bragging I got a couple homies really with it and they gun at it Look, he tryna fuck it, but I done had it Low baby Alright, so you went to the Dom Kennedy, Dom Kennedy, Dom Kennedy, fool, you're a real R word. B- BBC. Be- beaner over here. Yes, I went to, yes, I went to a Dom Kennedy or Dom Ketamine. Uh, what? How do you I say? was on Ketamine though. <laughs> Dom Kennedy, dog. Oh, Dom Kennedy, OPM, other people's money, dog. One of my favorite rappers out there. Uh, he is your favorite rapper? Yeah, my, uh, yeah, he probably is one of my favorite. I'm a little groupie for that one, but I always go to his shows, dog. And this one was out here at the Novo. He always performs at Novo, and it was a first show and second show. And on the road, it was fucking a great time. Have you ever yeah. been, have you ever seen him? No, I never seen him, but I like he's his your music. Though, right? I can see you fucking with him. Yeah, it's cool. It's pothead music. It's like you smoke weed to that shit, and you fuck a, a bitch in Jordans. No, hundred percent. It's like it's like backwood and Jordan music. It's lookout. It's it's lookout music. You find a lookout. You know what a lookout is, right? Obviously. Look, look out, like, like a, a lizard, city lookout. Lizard lady? 
Lizard lady. Lizard alley or what do you call those no. bitches? No. Oh, uh, <laughs> lot lizard. No, 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 no. no. Uh, You're not, not fucking a lot lizard. A lookout. <laughs> a lookout is like, so Lake Elsinore, back there in my hometown, shout out to the IE Kings. Uh, Lake Elsinore. <laughs> <laughs> bro, there's people in the comments always saying, hell yeah, XGIE, IE, IE, <laughs> dog, right, Kings. But shout out to Lake Elsinore. A lookout. I don't know if in LA you guys have these things called lookout, but a lookout is somewhere in your so city. So, that looking out, Trusha? Yeah, so, okay, th- pretty much. So, a lookout is somewhere in your city where you go on, like, on top of the city and you look over the city. And that's where you, like, you first make out with your first female and you take them there because you don't have nowhere to go. So you take them to a lookout. Lake Elsinore had a famous lookout because you look over the lake. Oh, like a, a broke bitch. What do you mean a broke bitch? A bitch that's look out. You, you have nowhere to go to make out. Bro, so this you is have to go like when you're 16, street. 17, 18. This is before your parents let you go. I've never heard of a lookout. A lookout was all keep, keep through. It's child. a night thing out there. We go to the lookouts. We bone. We fucking finger bang bitches at the lookout. Uh, through child, keep, keep, hey, keep lucha. I'm gonna catch a spot. Keep through child. Hey, you be a lookout fool. If there's no cops. So where do you guys go? Where do people in LA go to finger bang bitches when you don't have a pad? The fucking Target, Walmart parking lot. I just used to go to the school. I would jump That's back. That's shit, dog. You can't be getting your dick sucked outside of school, dog. You see what I mean? You gotta go to the lookout. They can also look out on top of the fucking lake. We call it the G spot. Yeah, because you guys we call have the G spot too, dog. G spot. Why the G spot? Because you get the G spot. You're at the G spot. And you hit the G spot. You used to be like, yo, I'm You're in my lady. fucking high school. You didn't know what a G spot's at. We act like you know know about bitches back then. You know about no bitches. You're being a hater right now, dog. You're really oh. being a major <laughs> hater on the fucking lookout, dog. It's uh, romantic, dude. When you're 16 and you take your bitch to a fucking lookout, bro. And, and you, you can bring go one to or two lookout. talk hands, one or two talk hands, and then you see the sunset. She gets romantic. You play that some N- sunset. You play some NB Riders. What song is that? You don't know NB Riders? Just sing me the song. I can't sing, dog. I'm uh, not Tommy, right. dude. I'm not three place Tommy, bro. I'm not a fucking jukebox. <laughs> you just fucking say, here, the, here's the, a dollar. You're, you're three ecstasy XG, you know? <laughs> I'm, I'm kind of sad. I'm kind of disappointed. Bro, you never been at the lookout, bro. Well, look we out. Like, head, head at the lookout, bro. You're just like smoking a blunt at the lookout. The sunrise going down. You're looking at the infamous Lake of Lake Elsinore, bro. It's fucking <laughs> fire, <stupid>. bro. <laughs> <laughs> no wonder people are all romantic over there. The I, dog, what the fuck? We have a lake. We have a MacArthur Park. <laughs> hey, hey, look at some fucking bums out here and some fucking... Nah, see, dude, this is what I mean, bro. It's all I shit. All right, so lookout <laughs> is a bitch that has no, no money that you take to a free spot. No, lookout is a spot where you got nowhere to go. You and your lady are being horneados. So you're telling me a lookout's a broke bitch or horny Dude, bitch. You know what's Which the worst part? Is, is when you go to the lookout and there's already someone there and you're like, damn, uh, they're getting you <laughs> before me, dog. Look, look, you're trying to participate, start an orgy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look at me scan. Oh, look at me scan. <laughs> a scam. Bunch of scamming, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking bunch of Indian ass bullshit scamming people. <laughs> 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 so all right, so you took uh, uh, Don Kennedy is a show where you take no look out uh, bitches. Yeah, what? yeah, look yeah. Don, Don yeah. Kennedy's music, uh, yeah, yeah. It's it's, it's, it's it's music you play at the lookout. You know, you play some Don it's Kennedy. It's a bitch that smokes fucking for sure. Backwards. Yeah, like Larry June. She, Larry has, every, June she has every Jordan that comes out. Hundred percent. Yeah. First day it comes out, she has those Jordans. She's got them on. All right, so you took you got to take one of those bitches. Yeah, no, but the concert was lit, dude. But like you said, a bunch of fucking fine little females. Yeah. Now they're smoking weed. Did you pick up on any? Hmm. Oh, no, I can't ask you that. Yeah, don't bad. ask me that shit, dog. <laughs> <laughs> nah, me porté bien, dog. Shout out to my lady. She gave, uh, she gave, my, she gave, she gave my ticket. Yeah, she got a shout-out. She shout gave out. my ticket. Yeah, she gave my ticket hey. out to my homie. Hey, text, hey. Her, text her 20 bucks for the shout-out. 20 bucks for the shout-out. I got a free haircut now. I got a free haircut. I got a free haircut. Oh, shout-out shit, to my lady. I'm going to be looking good next week for the shout-out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's why you don't look good ever, dog. You don't give your girls a lady shout out, bro. You give them a shout out. Be like, yo, what's up? I shouted your OnlyFans. No, shoot me 50 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> Suck my dick. <laughs> so, shout out to your girl. <laughs> so, what was it? Did you go with your girl or was it like a boys' no, night out? I, I, I was supposed to go with my lady, but she wasn't feeling well. So, I was like, if you're not feeling well, don't it, let's not wait this. She's a Dom fan or not? Yeah, nah. Nah. So she wasn't feeling good, and then when she told me she wasn't feeling good, I, pl- I, I played that card. I'm like, hey, if you're not feeling good, the homie would appreciate to come because it was sold out. She was like, shoot it. 
Give it she to your homie. Go, she let you boys go. Boys night, dog. Boys, boys night. night, homie. Did and I get... proved it, too, because on Instagram, I posted all the homies right there. I was like, look, I'm with the homies. <laughs> <laughs> look, a cock fest. <laughs> look, I'm at the dom show, not getting any dome. <laughs> yeah, there's no bitches here, baby. It's just the homies, baby. You heard that song by Dom Kennedy? Ain't no bitches here, baby. It's just the homies. <laughs> and then two short plays. And then you see some bitch with a Jordan in the back looking good as fuck. Like, who's that little hood rat? <laughs> My blunt's got lipstick all over it. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! No, me porté bien, portése bien. C C C. Is there, there are people smoking weed in there? Hell yeah! No, nah, dog. Like I'm not gonna hot box. Hot box the fuck out of that place. I don't dog. get it. They always you can smoke in there all you want, huh? Bro, they don't care. I don't think the Novo cares anymore. No you passed through the metal detector, that's but that's it. Does my blunt got metal in it? I hope not. Does then. my K got metal in it? Does your perico got metal in it? If it's fancy, your maybe. Lean got, if it's fancy. Fuck, lean foods are just going with styrofoam cups in there at this point? Yeah. Fuck, I don't give a fuck. No, but it was boys' night, dog. Boys' night. Were you behaved good? Like the, the, the Boy, on boys' night, you, you got to come home, dog. What time, did you get, what time was the show over? Two. Lying ass food. Swear to God. Is she watching the show right now? Full show started at 11. Is she, is she, watching, <laughs> hey, is she, wa is she watching the show? She's sleeping. She's okay, still she's sleeping. sleeping. <laughs> yeah. Oh, 2 a.m. Yeah, I saw I saw the the lineup of the song. It was at over at 2. <laughs> so you got home at 2 from boys' night. And your girlfriend wasn't tripping? Mm -hmm. Your girl wasn't tripping? Like, what do you mean it was over at 2? Like, I've been seeing other people's story and it was over at fucking 11.30 at night. Well, see, that's when you, there was two shows. I didn't go to the first show. I went to the second show. I like that. That's a good excuse. Facts. So she didn't trip on you for one on boys' night? Nah, for she was sick. She gave me the ticket. She gave you the ticket? Well, she gave me that. I mean, I had an extra ticket. Wrapped her money right there. <laughs> but Gas money but, right there. <laughs> so I, I would expect your girl not to let you go, especially you. She, she let you out like that. Like, other guys can't go out. Well, well, first she was like, what's the lineup? And then she heard Noah's fucking veneer. Oh. She's like, you can go. <laughs> you told you told her going with me. She's like, oh, hell no, nah, fuck. I'm that. not sick no more. <laughs> I'm a huge Tom Kennedy she, fan. I'll get there an hour early. I'll be <laughs> yeah. waiting in line for you. Uh, just, just meet up with me. Meet up. I'm like, fuck. well, last time I was like, yo, can come? Cause she was like, oh, let's go to brunch. And I was like, oh, you're home. Brunch. Here. I was. Like, See, I'm glad I didn't invite you. Argument number no, I'm three. Glad, I'm glad I didn't. I'm glad I didn't invite you. Cause the other day she was like, hey, let's go to brunch. And I was like, your female friends coming over. She's like, yeah. I was like, I'm inviting Manier. She's like, I don't know if that's a good idea. I'm glad what? I did it now. Why? They would have had a blast. You didn't me. even want to go now. Instantly said brunch. And you're like, never mind. I would have showed up after 12. It would have just been lunch. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? And you <laughs> wanted to pay for the tab too. Yeah, I would have bounced, I would have bounced before that. Like, I'm out. You would have been like, text me when they drop off the check. <laughs> <laughs> fuck these bitches. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so, boys' night. Let's speak about boys' night. You had one, and the next day you were fine? Is there Okay, wait up, wait up. They didn't okay, hit you? Okay, before I tell you, is there girls? Is there rules to boys' night? Shit, I haven't had a girlfriend in so long, so I don't... Is there I, rules? It, when you go out with your homies, do you not post the homies? Because that's rules right now. If you... Like, I see my homie be like, don't post me, dog. No matter what, just leave me out the equation, dog. Like, don't just don't... I don't want her to be like, oh, what's this, what's well, that? I posted a video today. I did a, a video of the other night we had on, like, on Friday, and I hit up the homie like, hey... I send him the video, I go, hey, is this fine to post or will you get in trouble? She's all like, look at you being a homie uh, for one, what making the sure fuck? people don't break up. <laughs> He's all like, come back to be like, I hope she sees this. <laughs> I, I hope y'all break up. Let's remind her you still get bitches, fool. <laughs> <laughs> so I sent the video, he approved it. He's like, good, it was a boys' night. Uh, but he's not like in a committed relationship, so it don't matter. Like rule, I think there is a rule though. If you're what? having boys' night and your girl lets you out, you can't spend the night. But you tell us the rule could be you're in a relationship, so uh, you can't what, spend what, the night. What, that's what they tell you, like hey. I don't know. No one told me. There's no rules. My girl didn't give me a rule list. Like hey, your boys' night here comes with the rules <laughs> list. Like the fuck, dog. <laughs> but there is rules to it, right? Well, I think I don't know. I just think if you definitely, first of all, if you're if it's boys' night, either you go back to your pad. This is fine. You go back to your pad. You got your own bachelor pad. You go back there. But you can't spend the night at your homie's pad. Because either you're doing the homie or your girl oh, thinking you're doing someone else. Just what? saying, though, you can't just say, oh, I passed that at the homies. What? Bro, your girl's going to be like, you passed that at the homies? Like, you have your own what, apartment. What, what, why don't you go home? Huh? What, what, why is she going to trip at that? What's wrong with that? You guys, you went, you drove to the homie's house, right? 
before the whole get the whole no, party. No, you Ubered. First of all, you oh. okay? That's it. Okay, full. You know our fans are not Ubering anywhere. These fools are drinking and driving. Don't risk a DUI, man. Don't risk a DUI, Okay, he's not risking a DUI. Well, okay, he's not risking a DUI. He, he got out of work. Hey, fool, meet up at my house at 9 p.m. He's not gonna take an Uber to that fool's house. All right, he, all right, all right. I'm Touché, a, I'm a, touché, touché. I'm gonna park the Raptor outside. Okay. Worst comes to worst, I'll sleep in the no, car. This better food for better have a garage for the Raptor dog. I'm not putting that shit outside. Stupid. I don't have a garage. You better have the fucking tarp. A little tarp at least, <laughs> para que no le pegue la lluvia. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Fuck it. All right. So you drive to the homie's house. Meet up at nine. We're going to start pre drinking here. You get there. You park. And you guys go out, right? You call your lady. You're like, hey, babe. What the fuck you got to call that bitch for? You're already out. I, I, already, I already told you I was going out. Why do you got to fucking. I got to the location. I made it safe. That bitch don't give a fuck. Well, she does give a fuck, but she. You shouldn't give a fuck. I got here. You can't but, just be. You can't just be like, hey, babe. You can't just be like, hey, babe. I'm going to go have some drinks. With the compa, and then next thing you know, you're at the fucking club with bottle service. Boys night. <laughs> the fuck? Yeah, boys what, night. What did you want the whole rundown? We don't know. We're guys. We don't plan it. See All right. So you super, already super okay, brunch or okay, brunch okay. activities. So, so the thing is, you told you started off telling your lady, "I'm having boys night." That's it. You acted. You know. You first you said, "I get off work. I'm gonna go to the homie's house." That's two different things. Going to the homie's house and having boys night. When you tell your lady, "I'm having boys night." She knows Perico might be involved. She already, <laughs> she's, she's, already, she's just like, she already knows, she's already but, know what she's but doing you know, with. But you know this bitch can't say shit because she just had girls night. <laughs> she, she had brunch on yeah. Sunday and you're here on a Monday trying to have a bender. <laughs> <laughs> so right, you get, so you, you're going to call her when you get there. Like when you parked at, at LA Live, did you call your girl and be like, oh, I parked in uh parking lot two. Number 24. No, you're right. You're right. The second I just the second I left the house, I'm like, hey, I just called an Uber. I'm on the way to the concert. That's it. That's it. Phone's disconnected. The only thing you're going to see is my story. D&D? <laughs> D&D comes out on the text? Yeah. I'll, the only text I want is I'm this dying. pussy waiting for you. <laughs> I, that might make me leave. You know, there's things that I'm like, all right. What? Uh, but this pussy's waiting for you. Duh, you're my girlfriend. It should be waiting for me. So? What the fuck? I already had so? that pussy. I'm sometimes outside. I forget. I'm sometimes outside, I forget. Bitch, I'm outside. And sometimes you're there. Sometimes you're at, you're, you're at the fucking concert. And you're like, oh, fuck. That shit look good. That shit look good. <laughs> I was like, and then you get a text. You're like, oh, we'll get there. Well, if I, okay, you're not, you're not like this, but for men like me, I, I'm outside. <laughs> That be look good. That be look good. Oh, you're rolling up a and hey, smoke goes up, girl. Let's roll up a blunt. And it never fucking always happens. This fool swears he's a, he, this fool swears he's got a batting average of a hundred thousand. Like he's never missed a beat, dog. I swear I want. I can't wait for these vlogs where I'm be like, yo, scumbags, they look good. What's up? And I'll I'll, I'll even do the icebreaker for you. I'll start it off. I gotta look at this in these vlogs because th this <laughs> I gotta look at this in these vlogs. This podcast is already not getting me laid. This is making it complicated for me. Every time I hit up a girl that follows the scum and kick it, they're like, oh, well, you hear shit like this, dog? It's funny, my game. Men like me. <laughs> <laughs> Real men cheat sometimes. Not, I don't. <laughs> I don't cheat often. Happening now, the hard summer festival going on this weekend on the grounds of SoFi Stadium is having an unfortunate consequence. Residents and communities miles away are still being subjected to the noise. Fox 11's Hal Eisner is live and he can explain this. Nobody cares. Nobody cares. It's hard summer 2024 at the SoFi Stadium in Inglewood. Two day event, Saturday, Sunday, with crazy performances by Disclosure side piece fisher and chris lake nothing but good times and you could hear it was loud it was hard it was hot so me and the homies had to pull up link in the bio just a little recap hit the like button and subscribe all right so back to it all right 9 p.m you show up to your boy's house all right you guys are getting drunk right all right hey let's go we're gonna start off drinking here Pre-drinking, get there at 9. You guys are going to take off to the spot at 10.30. How many beers are, gonna, are, are you going to chug from 9 to 10.30? You're coked out, so you're probably going to do like 12 <laughs> beers. Or how many? Like, Let's say a, a nice four beers, right? From yeah. 9 to 10.30? Two, three, at yeah. At a shot. You're at the homies house like, you're outside, fool. Let's take a shot or what? I'm down. I don't give a fuck. You're all bad boy right now. I don't give a fuck. Take a shot. Go to the club. You already see your girl texting like, what time are you getting home? What do you tell her? Or you're not replying? I don't reply. It's I'm still on D and D, dude. I just took off my weed receipts off. Your weed receipts? Read. 
The oh, read re receipts? <laughs> red. Yeah, because I red, have red, red receipts. Yeah, I have red receipts. I don't, I'll let you know. But that's one moment in time. like, just take that off. Uh, <laughs> Stupid. Yeah. Gonna, she gonna, she gonna be suspicious with that one. That's a, that's a no. Red. I'm not saying you take it off. Like you don't take it off, but you don't. At least you don't read it. You don't read it. You just read it through the top. Taking off the red. Yeah, you just read it through the top as notification. You just don't open it because there's no reason to open it. Like what the? I'm fucking clubbing. I'm having a great time. Like don't, just don't open it. Because I have read receipts. I really, you'll know. And to me, it's like, yo, you know when I read it. If I want to ignore, you will know exactly when I decided to ignore you at 5:45. At that a moment in time, I decided to not write back to you. At 8 a.m. Yeah, oh, this guy's tough. For well, a lot of people, no that, a lot of people that I text have the red receipts. But you're gonna not read until like 5 a.m. No, I like I like knowing if they ignored me or not. Sometimes I think they did or they didn't, and I remind them like, "Are you ignoring me?" I don't have that shit. And they'd be like, "No, I forgot. I really forgot to text you back." I was like mid. I don't know. To me, I like red receipts. And to me, I want to let you know. I just left you red. I just let. I just ignored you at five forty-five. <laughs> For, uh, ignoring your crap five forty-five is like, kind of crazy. And whenever though, the thing is, I need you to know that you got ignored. Because people always like, I wonder if you still read it. Yes, bitch, I read it, and I'm leaving you on fucking red. Is what I want you to know. I want to establish that. All right, so you don't leave it on red because you're like, I don't want her to read it. I, I like leaving them in suspense. See, but there's no suspense. They already know you read it. We're always on our phones 24-7. Like, not, you, not me. Does anybody, any, any bitch really think like, oh, my God, he hasn't read my text in six hours. No, I need her to know that at 545, I decided to just leave your ass on I, I, I read it and I didn't give a fuck. So you're playing that guy. I read it, but I don't care. Right. That's more you. But That's more you. I, 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 me. I don't. Even yes. Have, I don't. Even have I'm that. surprised that you don't have that instead of me. You're more of a. Yeah. Yo, yeah. I read it, bitch. I don't give a fuck. Like I don't give a fuck. Like yeah. You already sucked my dick. Who cares? <laughs> <laughs> like why are we arguing? Like yeah. Okay. Thank you for the good yeah. morning message. <laughs> you already sucked my dick. Why do I care? You already Ubered home. Why do I care? <laughs> <laughs> You're home already. Who cares? <laughs> you see what I mean, dude? I think. I think he's about to go to settings. <laughs> setting section. <laughs> well, I saw. You don't reply. All right, you don't reply. So you're out, and you think uh, when you go on, on boys' night, do they tell you what time to get home? Like me, if I, if I had a girl, she's like, yeah, I'm going to have girls' night. All right, have fun, be safe, and that's it. But you think girls are like, hey, you better be home by 2, or what's, did your girl ask you what time are you getting home? No, I don't think she, this isn't, I don't know. My parents don't even ask me when I was getting home. <laughs> even when I was in high school, it's just, I'll get home when well, I get home. your parents didn't care about you, but your you girlfriend just to, does. You just don't spend the night. Eventually, you got to text your lady like, hey, I just got home. Or at least say, hey, I'm going to spend the night at my homie's house because I'm too drunk. You can't just leave it as in like nothing happened last night. But you think she's going to believe you when you say, I'm going to spend the night at my homie's house because I'm too drunk. But start taking pictures. <laughs> Better go live. <laughs> Better bell. go FaceTime. Yeah, <laughs> take a picture off panel right there. <laughs> Not because they, they won't even, they'll play. I don't give a fuck. You better get your ass home Uber right me. now. Uber me. I'll send you my ID. <laughs> you you drove over there, you better drive your ass back, and they're, they'll make you risk a DUI. Oh, see, that's toxic. See? See? But, Bye, leave. Any bitch, if you tell a bitch I'm drunk and she still says, I need you to come or I don't care, bro, that bitch is not good for your life. But I had a homie like that, like, We'll be having barbecues, right? Every Sunday we say at barbecues. The full show, but I get let up full of beer. Start drinking. Next thing you know, his girl's like, where are you at? I'm where I'm at every Sunday at the homie pal. We did, I'm not like, we did have bitches there. Well, I would bring bitches for me, you know? I'm not here like, hey, everybody's going to get laid, guys. Like, a bitch for you, a bitch for you. No. Okay, Oprah. I, it's a bitch for me. <laughs> another bitch for me, I hope. And another bitch for me. So then his What about the fourth one? You can't have four. Maybe I mean, you can, maybe but she's on her, that's maybe selfish. Number one's on a rag. Number two doesn't want to fuck to the third date. Number three is going to wait for these two bitches to bounce at 10. They want to stay until 11. Then we go fuck. You got you to plan it out, bro. Oh, I thought you wanted all four of them at once. I was like, wait up, dude. No, I got to have, I, I, I have them all at the same time. I want them to fucking fight over me. They, they, like, who, who's going to flirt with me more? Blah, blah, blah. I got to get one jealous in front of her face, you know? But you got to play it cool. Anyways, that, you gotta that, play cool, guys. You gotta play cool. Play it cool. Just play cool. Hey, you're the Just prize. Play cool, Just play cool. Just be the cool guy. You're the prize. <laughs> let, them, let them know that. Damn, that fool's around bomb bitches and he's not even losing his mind. Like, he's just fucking casual. He's getting every bitch a plate. He got every girl up here. Oh, he made a drink for all of us? Damn, who, who does he like? Every bitch got tacos al pastor. <laughs> <laughs> tacos de chorizo <laughs> on the table. Right, so. <laughs> Boys' night. What time do you get home on a boys' night? 
What? On, you you have you just have to get home. There's no time. Like you're a fucking grown man. No, there's you no can't time. get home. At, no, no, you're a grown three. man. There's no time. No, there's no. Your girl shouldn't text you. You better be home by three. You, you better be home by four. You she you just gotta tell like, hey bitch, I'm gonna be home. If you live with her, you gotta be home. If you're by yourself, you gotta go to your pad. Even Uber, like when you, you text you, her, be like, hey, I don't know, dude, but you can't spend. You can't just. You can't go to boys' night and then not even say, hey, good night, bitch. I just got to the homie's house. At least that. For well, she wakes up and she don't see no good morning, no good night. Oh, that's bad news, well, bro. When she wakes up. Boys night. You, she just gave you boys night and this bitch can't get a good night, good morning message. Oh, bro. It's over. But well, you're never well, getting boys night again. That's the last boys night of your life. What do you mean wakes up, though? Have it scheduled. Have it scheduled where your phone texts her at 4 in the morning <laughs> saying, Good night, bitch. I'm going to sleep. Buenas noches. I love you. At least you can just say, hey, I, 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 I was pedo, but I was all pedo at four in the morning, but I still text you, bitch. You know, I love you. I, uh, I'm in love with you, Jaina. Uh, like, uh, it's amor de verdad. Whatever. <laughs> if, you, if you text her, let me know when you're here. What do you mean? Because you fucked up and you text the wrong bitch, let me know when you're here. You already told another bitch to come and you done fucked up because you're like so pedo. Oh, that's why I just said you're never having a boys' night ever again. <laughs> what I just say? I, what I just say that statement? You're never having a boys' night ever a fucking again. So, uh, <laughs> So how many boys night can you have a week then? What's up? What's the a week, th dog? A week? a week? You want boys night a week? I haven't been in a relationship in like twenty years. So dude, how do you, you know might get boys what night. You might get boys. Dude, boys night a week twice a month sounds like a lot. To twice a, lot a of month? What kind of shit is this? Is that your mom or your girlfriend? You can only go out twice. You can only go to the playground twice a month. You're Even talking as a kid. I was outside. No, no, no. no. More You're often. talking all. Boys' night means all What's night. Wrong with boys', boys night? night means strip club. Boys' night means casino. You're talking about boys just, night. no. You're talking about just going to the homies' garage and chilling. That's Bro. boys' night, right? No, that's there's boys', boys no. night. It's, a night. it's boys', boys night. night. It's, boys' night is periquiar. It's like, but you're gonna do that in the garage. Once the boys are together, you already know there's gonna be perico. There's gonna be beer. There's gonna be conversation about where the bitches, but nobody has bitches. <laughs> and then, like, that's the common shit always. So you can't say like a casual. You never go to your homie's house like, hey fool, I I'm I'm gonna pull up and let's be sober for the next three hours. No, but I pull up to never. the homies. I pull up to the homies pad and it's a casual. Yo, dude, I'm pulling up around five six. We're gonna have three or four of them. Don't bring out the perico, please. Like, three, or, dog, three or four bitches? Mm? Three or four bitches. Ah, oh, weak ass kickback. <laughs> oh, sorry ass kickback. Three or f Bro, people, there's no bitches waiting at the kickback? That's not boys night. That's yes, literally it chilling with the homies. There's two different things. They're <laughs> chilling with the homies and there's boys night. George Perez, like Monday night, is chilling with the homies. Monday night, when we podcast with George, that's chilling with the homies. Everyone drinking, we smoking. Boys night is when we go to Funk Freaks, we go to the comedy store, the perico comes out. Like you said, everyone said they're gonna bring bitches, no bitches show up. <laughs> That's boys night, dog. Everybody got chilling with the boys night. Yeah, <laughs> chilling with the homies is just chilling with the homies, dog. So what? it's like fishing. Chilling with the homies, chilling with the homies three times a week. Chill with the homies three times a week. That's boys in the girl's eyes. That's boys' night. That you you, you gotta explain to you, your bitch. No, you, you can't then, explain shit to the bitch. She's already gonna think like. Three times a week? What do you mean? You're, you don't want to be around me three days out of the week? You must be cheating. You know how bitches are. They're going to start thinking No, you're this right, you're right, you're right, you're, you're right, you're right, like you're right. It's because you, you can't say, you can't like give a, t like when they hear it like that, that's when they go, oh, you rather do this and that. You can't just say that. Like, because you, you're a comedian, so, okay, I get it. He has to go to the comedy club. That's where he makes his money. But if we just got off, of, okay, nine to five, he gets off at five. I'm going to have boys night. Where? Oh, we're going to this bar. Oh, the bar where those bitches are in bikinis? And you're like, yeah, they have good drinks there. And it's like, see, you're see, just, see, you're see, just see, going see. for the bitches. It's see, like, see. well, right. yeah, I'm tired of seeing your raggedy ass already. Like, you're not, you don't even have a bikini on right now, but chilling the bikini on the um on the vlog. <laughs> Go check it out, fishing vlog, <laughs> chilling the bikini. Every time bikini gets mentioned, chilling the bikini, you'll see it. Ch chilling the bikini, <laughs> fishing vlog. This supposed to hate but, me, dog. Uh, this was supposed to fucking hate me. A couple comments, like for real, dog. I, I watched the whole thing again. <laughs> Get it. It's not set as what at eight thousand views. 8, Let's views. get it to sixteen thousand. <laughs> you gotta just walk. You gotta just pay attention. Chili is in the key, in the bikini. Boys, now with with chili, my girlfriend's gonna trip. Is she gonna be in the bikini? When you gonna drink? Is she gonna be in the bikini in the garage? Like no, I don't think she's gonna be in the bikini in the uh, garage. But yeah, dude. All right, <laughs> <laughs> mate. I'm over here paying in the bikini, fishing. All right. So. You gotta come what, home, dog. What, what, you gotta no. come home. One time a week, 
You said three. That sounds no, no. legit. Chilling I, with I the like homies. That. Chilling with the homies three, three times, a, times week. a week. Chilling with the homies Chilling three times a week. Chilling with the homies is boys' night. Don't, don't no, say, bro. Your, your girl's going to try. I'm going to go with fucking. Okay. Let's all, all right. Right now. All right, right you, now. You right now. Right now. Okay. This right now. What we're doing right now is chilling with the homies. Okay. This is chilling with the homies. <laughs> this you wouldn't consider this chilling with the homies. You'd consider this boys' night out? What the fuck? This is a podcast, fool. Dog, this is chilling with the homies. You don't consider us this. I mean, yeah, we're recording, but we're chilling with the homies. I literally think this is chilling with the homies. Chill is here. Oh, wait, 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 watch. Now it's chilling with the homies. Hey, girls, come out. No, see, there's no bitches, so this can't be chilling with the homies. It's just fucking work. I don't know. This is not chilling with the homies. Chilling with the homies is not this. Whoa. And that's your ex G's girlfriend. Yes, this is chilling with the homies. Just us, casual time. Nothing crazy. Just popping some beers. But no, bro. You already know. Chilling with the homies. I guess all my homies are animals or something. Because chilling with the homies means everybody's out. Everybody's free. All my homies. I never had a girlfriend. So all my homies that have girlfriends are out. So they're sad. Like, hey, scum. What's up with that bitch you had the other day? And I was like, bro, she's not here, you know? <laughs> said, I've never had a girlfriend. <laughs> so I was like, all proud about it. Too. I've never had a girlfriend. <laughs> it's <was hilarious>. I never. <laughs> even, though he's, even though he's talked about having multiple girlfriends, he's like, I've never had a girlfriend. <laughs> well, and, uh, it's been a decade. It's already erased. It's, it's a criminal record. Like a criminal record after eight years. This isn't a cre- your. A credit, a credit, a credit report know, after This eight. isn't like my DUI. It doesn't get expunged, dog. It just doesn't disappear, dog. This is it. You're, you sound like those like those girls. Uh, who's that one girl? That uh, she wanted to restart her body count. So she got her Heimlich redone or some shit like that. Her she's Heimlich like, redone? Her Heimlich. Oh, I thought her Heimlich. Is that how you say it? Heimlich, Heimlich. I don't know. You lick it anyways. So. <laughs> 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 but yeah, this, oh, one, this one is this, this porn star or something like that where she got her pussy redone. You know, you've heard that, right? And she's like, oh, I got it redone, so then my body count restarts. No, That's no, how that. you sound, dog. After 10 years, my girlfriend count is zero. Bro, after, okay, cats have nine lives, dogs have a lot. Or right, after 10 years, you it's, it's a new world. I never had a girlfriend. After 10, I haven't had a girlfriend since 2009. So that's the, over 10 years. That's 15 the, years. Well, uh, give me an award. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> Shit, it's, just, it's hard out here to be single. It's complicated to be single, bro. Someone, I know. I see you on Tinder. It's oh, hard. Hell, hell no. Hell no. <laughs> that should never get no bitches. I, 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 I low-key want to see your profile. Yo, can you no, guys find I, Scumbag's profile on Tinder, dog? I, I want to see his erased, profile. I erased it after that You episode. erased it? Yeah, that show was getting no you, bitches. I, I'm pretty sure I asked you. What was your bio? Owner of Scum and Kick It. Owner scumbag. It's me, scumbags, and my co-host XG. <laughs> That's what the bio and says. And, 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 the and instead of a picture, and instead of picture, you put a real. <laughs> <laughs> like, no, nah, that shit is gone. I'm on back into my Instagram, picking up on girls on Instagram. The the it's easier on Instagram, bro, to pick up. I think it's Instagram is like the best dating app. No? I would say so. How did, okay, how did you meet your girl? On Instagram? In real life? In real life. Yeah? Yeah, fool. At a rave? <laughs> people, meet, people meet people in real I life? I thought everyone's surprised. In real life? Whoa. <laughs> you saw her? No Wi-Fi? What? No. The fuck? No Wi-Fi? <laughs> Is she real? Yeah, so I, okay. <laughs> Damn, I haven't picked up on a bitch in real life in a long time. It's harder than you think. No, yeah. <laughs> I hate it because the homies always be like, when we be outside, they're like, oh, look at that bitch right there. Go holler at her, fool. Like, damn, fool, I don't know how to, I don't even know what to say. Instagram. Yeah, what's well, my answer? And then she sees my Instagram. She's like, oh, you're popping. All right, yeah. Oh, that's the first thing you show me. Like, oh, you see that following count? <laughs> Stupid. I have a shirt with my QR code. <laughs> like, oh, yeah, just scan, just scan and we'll keep scan talking. Scan to, t- scan to talk. Well, what's funny is they'll scan it and they'll see your following. And they're yeah, like, man, I'll ruin all my whole shit. Or my, it might help Instagram. it. Or it might help it. What are you talking about? Bitches love a nice little fat following. I'll be honest with you. Once they, I, t- I don't even. That's I made the personal one. Once, once they see my Instagram, the scumbag one. Pfft. That's because your Instagram says scumbag. When I show bitches of my Instagram, well, can I be myself? <laughs> <laughs> the fuck, I'm just being myself. I want an honest man, bitch. I'm being honest. Yeah, when I showed my girl my Instagram, she was like, "Wow, he's famous." <laughs> <laughs> see, but you don't have a girl shaking ass on your face, so it's different. Like you're like, oh yeah, shit. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. Most girls that you interact with have a way bigger following than I will ever have. These bitches got like 100,000 subscribers. I know they do. 
They do. So like you have a nice following, but like to bitches like that, it's irrelevant. Yeah, no, to, 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 to a regular like, bitch, yeah, unless you work at McDonald's, twenty thousand ain't shit. <laughs> Even if you know the McDonald's worker don't want to do it like oh no there's a booty shaking on his face uh, if he gets a bunch of bitches oh yeah I don't and, have and, that, and not only and not only do you have a, a, a big old booty shaking on your Instagram it's like pinned it's the first thing you see it's come back and then it's a big culote right here it's just a reminder I get bitches <laughs> no it's yeah. a reminder of I stay single <laughs> <laughs> Damn, imagine if I was looking for a relationship that should be so complicated oh you gotta take that off dog there's this one picture Chili knows about it there's one picture I was in Vegas, and it was uh yeah, dude. There's a big old booty. There's a big old booty next to me. It's one of my favorite pictures, and I hate that. It's one of my favorite pictures. And I want to post it every three months. Post it right now. Nah, right bro. now. Nah, bro. You'll it's be sing- you'll be single tomorrow. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Hey, wanna go out tonight, boys' night? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it all up. <laughs> Fuck up the whole bag. But yeah, there's some shit you gotta delete, dog. Some shit that you gotta act ex- memory bank. Can't be verbal no more. Just leave it, y'all. Delete it, dog. Why you think your your girl would trip? Like, even though it's an old picture, yeah, I can I can pull off like, yo, this was taken before you were around. But she'll still trip, right? Yeah, you, why, you got. Should it be allowed to trip if the picture was from 2023? Like, bitch, I didn't even know you existed. Is she allowed to trip? <sighs> it's the thing, cause I do want to post that picture, so I want to say but, no. <laughs> 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 no, honestly, like, bitches be training about it. Oh, so what's j- okay? Why are you posting the picture? The only reason I, w- I would agree with you, it, repost- the only reason I would agree with you why you can repost it is because she most likely is wearing your merch, and you're like, bitch, I'm just trying to sell more merch. You know, I'm trying to put more money in uh, the my bank. My Instagram is me just trying to sell my merch. I'm in my best behavior nah. all the time. This is all this all work activity is what I'm saying. That picture I have with that big booty, it's all work activities. I'm wearing tinfoil hat, t-shirt, tinfoil you're, hat. T-shirt. You're doing stand-up? Sam paid like, for hello, it. Guys. Sam paid for it. Sam was like, well, we need to sell t-shirts. And I was like, how do we do it? And then <laughs> sex sells. Yeah, you're dragging Sam into this? Sam 100% was, Shout out to Sam I said it to Sam I said it to Sam And someone was like Yeah we're selling t-shirts now It's an old ass picture But you know You get some stupid ass chick To put a cool on it Her face isn't on it That's not the thing Is her face isn't so even on it So if your girlfriend trips Will you be like You know Well then why don't we Just remake this picture Put your cool Hundred percent, but she's not that chick, though. You don't want. I don't want her to be that chick. I don't want her to be oh. that chick. I don't want her to be a fucking chick like that. That's the thing. Well, you're right. You're right. The answer would be like, well, then you put the school on. Yeah, you, you put the school <laughs> on right here. But then not, nah, dog. Nah, you know, I, that's not the chick. But, but nah, why, it's why not. Can't... It's not. I would have stuck with the chick that was in the picture. <laughs> if that's what I wanted, I would have been like here. Was she bomb? Hmm? Was she bomb? The bitch. Be cool when she was. I mean, I'm not with her. She wasn't that bomb. She should have been cooler for the picture. Not gonna lie, for the picture, it looks great. Hey, repost it tonight. Well, but today, obviously, there's Wednesday a reason I'm not with her. Wednesday at 9 p.m., that picture is gonna get reposted. <laughs> yeah. No, it will not get reposted. <laughs> <laughs> if he reposts out, he's gonna get reposted. And then I kick this fool out. He's not able to come here no more. <laughs> nah, but like I said, if you want it, if you had a lady, you had to delete that one. Not delete it, but you can't repost it. Bro. If, it's, a, if it's, a, it's in the feed, it's in the feed, dog. If it, she wants to scroll down and find it, that's a whole different thing, too, Ima- though. Imagine if I get a girlfriend, she says, like, hey, scum, erase all your naughty pics. Bro, you have, no, you have no camera roll. Bro, I'm going to be tired. You have no by, life. I'm going to be tired by 2022. I'm going to be like, damn, I got to go to 2012? Oh, you, there's this thing called all. Select all. No trip, dog. <laughs> there's this thing that I'm for select all. You're not going to click every one of them jerk off <laughs> to everything before <laughs> you delete it. <laughs> Oh, I remember her. Oh, man. All right, give me a second, babe. I'm almost done. I'm five minutes in. <laughs> two months, man. I'll be like, I need two months. I need two months. Just start jacking up to everything. Oh, You'd shit. be okay with old pictures of her, man, on her Instagram, dog? All enamorados, all fucking babe down, dog. You'd be okay? Scumbags would be like, it's her past. It's her past. She was in love. You'd be all right? Or is she deleting that shit too, dog? We're breaking up. If I see another point you're paying, we're breaking up. I don't give a fuck. I'm trying to see your dad on there. I'm trying to see you hug, hug your cousin, hugging your uncle. I don't give a fuck. You're cheating. Cheating. Yeah. That's your primo? Yeah, right. Show me the paperwork. Al, al primo se la rima. <laughs> <laughs> if your primo's ex cheat, for sure we're breaking up. <laughs> this fool is a savage. <laughs> Hell, I well, you got to worry that. about me and my dad. <laughs> 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 your dad has pictures of dad. <laughs> senior? Wow, dog. I, I got to meet senior one day. Dude. You guys would fucking, dude, 
crazy it, collab at Hong Kong. Imagine, you and my dad crazy collab at Hong Kong. My dad would be at Hong Kong wearing a scumbag t-shirt, getting lap dances. Uh, <laughs> You're right there too. <laughs> I'm in the back because my I'm girl's paying, not I'm letting me there. <laughs> my dad, you, you were drove, you, a drove you drove up there and dropped us off. <laughs> You're like, <laughs> this is boys' night, you fucking idiot. <laughs> Real senor night. <laughs> <laughs> and man, me and your dad would be like, hey, if you have boys night, oh, where are you going? Your dad's house. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. What's up, you guys? We're here with one of our sponsors, Chili Millie. Go buy her art. She has these dope ass canvases she just made. We got fucking, who is it, Michael Michelangelo? And what pizza, my favorite food? And what do you, what do you got over there, X? Oh, right here, dog. The Virgin Mary. Marge Mary, this one's dope, dog. As a Mexican, I you know I can't I gotta represent the Virgin Mary, but this one's dope. It's a nice <laughs> canvas. Put this on your wall. It's literally good ass quality. Trust me, we're not joking around. These are dope. Uh, go go get this at chillymilly dot shop. Hold on, let me let me hold that one real quick. Well, you're gonna make that thing an unvirgin. Damn, Damn I, chill. Haven't, I haven't had chill. a virgin. I haven't don't had get a that virgin. pregnant. I haven't had a virgin in a long chill, time. Chill, dog. Don't be that dude. That's that, that's the beat. That's. <laughs> That's baby Jesus' fucking mom, dude. Right. Calmate. So that's what you virgins look like Mama's nowadays? Bass with me right here, dude. This is Get this last virgin. They're going off the market. There is no more virgin, so get this last one. I don't condone this. What's the website? Chili Millie Shop. Chili Millie Top Shop. I love Jesus. Don't I don't condone this. Damn, though, I had to go take a piss. You had to go do some coke. <laughs> but but how the fuck did you get a new shirt? Bro, I was on a sick one, dog. I had to do you. I do outfit change like left, uh, lefty gunplay, dog. <laughs> <laughs> well, you got coke. You got coke on the other shirt, huh? Huh? You put some. You drip some coke on that the other can, shirt. Yeah, everyone's gonna notice. I had to get a new t-shirt. These shirts are dope, though, dog. Check this out. What are you wearing? For chilly mini exclusive. Exclusive. Look, look what I just got. She gave me a shirt too. <laughs> are you even a stoner, dog? Sometimes for the hey, don't be asking me questions like that, dog. I be smoking. You smoking? You think Chile smokes? The way she designs this art, you kind of have to smoke. Look at the, how creative uh -huh. this is, bro. This is like stoner. It's stoner some pothead shit. shit. This is a dope shirt. You guys, you guys got to go get it at, what's her website? Chili Millie Dop Shop. Chili Millie Dop Shop. These are dope. All the money goes to her. So go cop these for stoner activities. We don't smoke the same. You already know. Look at this. You can't go wrong with stoned ass Homer. And a couple but Damn, look at those buds. Bro, is there a time in life where you felt like you wanted like do the homer and disappear at this episode <laughs> god damn <laughs> damn so all right support chili that way she could quit her nine to five speaking of nine to five what do you think about people all right like if you have a girlfriend do you tell her to get a job or are you scared that she, she might get a job well first of all your girlfriend should already have a fucking job so you no, a fucking baller or what? No bum ass mommies. No bum ass mommies, dog. All right, but let's say you just met her. You just met her, and she didn't have a job, and she's been living with you for six months. And I know oh, she's a bum. You get a homeless <laughs> chick from Skid Row, dog. What did you just uh, Skid repeat, Row? Repeat. How how fine is this bitch, dog? Because what you just said is unreal. Okay, right. repeat it, do, it. it doesn't matter how fine she is. Okay, let's put it. Okay. Yeah, she has to be like she. Ha she, she has natural C cups. Okay, that's, Potentially that's good. these with a Victoria's Secret bra Ooh. because they be lying to the bitches. Yes, these are good. And then a handful of booty. Cute face. So you got she her. She work out? Yeah, she works out. She has time. She, she ain't working. The bitch is working out. She's <laughs> All she has to offer is her looks. All right, so you start dating her for six months. She starts saying like, damn, I'm ex, bored. I'm, yeah, I'm bored. Uh. I'm tired of being at home. I, I stay home wife. I want to get a job. And you know that if she gets a job, she might be, you might be in danger, or she might be in danger of getting picked up on, right? So, you, are you going to let her get a job or not let her get a job? Because if she gets a job, imagine you let her get a job and I'm working there. She's she gonna be like at the, she gonna be at the poker game like my boyfriend's outside. Well, what type? Well, that's that's one hundred percent. The question is, where is she getting this job at? What is she gonna do for a living? She working at Hooters. Fuck no, we're breaking up tomorrow. Hooters? I'll Hooters. work at Hooters. You let her work at Hooters, dog. You let your lady walk around at Hooters making fucking minimum wage, showing her fucking boobs, dog. The, at least fucking OnlyFans the, at that point. At that point, do OnlyFans, bitch. Hooters? <laughs> Hooters? Hooters? Hot wings and wings? You gonna finger yourself with those fucking buffalo fingers? But there's no guys working at Hooters, so 
You don't have no, but there's guys no there, rare. but there's guys. But they're customers. Girls never like the customer. They always say like, "Oh, I don't like." They're like the broke ass customers when the guy tips a hundred dollars <laughs> on a twenty dollar tab. Ain't no, Parks, she you gonna, gonna suck this fool's buffalo dick? <laughs> she, she, she gonna hoodie hoo, hoodie hoo. That's what she's gonna ask you. Who are you? Hoodie hoo. That's what she's gonna start asking you. Who's your boyfriend? Hoodie hoo. <laughs> exactly. Nah. Hoodie hoo. So yeah, you work at Hooters, bitch. Hoodie hoo. <laughs> so she's gonna forget about you. But hey, come on, think about it. No, no bother to go to fucking Hooters. Hooters is just like some. You're right, you're right. Hooters come is on, like. Bro. Hooters is like shit where my dad would take me. Pa' ver culito. Yeah. Right? <laughs> I'd be like, vamos a Hooters a ver culito. Y ahí andaba yo de morrito. Haciendo un culito, dog. Eating hot wings and shit. It ain't no Hong Kong. <laughs> but uh, let's say she gets a, a regular job. What's okay? What's a regular job? Let me okay. Lash tech? Oh. Lash tech? Do that all day, bitch. No, that's you with your little that's lash tech. That's not a regular job, but lash tech is a boss. Well, that is lash tech. Well, lash tech, tech is the tech. most basic female job in the world. But there's no man working there. Probably a gay ass fool. That's but what I mean. That's what, if your lady says I'm gonna be a lash tech, give it, do, send her to school, buy her her little no, outfit. No, no, you're playing. A, you're playing it safe, right there. That, that's a uh, mini boss, bitch. Now let's set her up in a situation where, like a clinic. She works at the clinic. You know, there's male nurses, right? And you know that food, that male Boy, nurse. She might have to see your chile if someone gets stabbed in there, bro. <laughs> a nurse saw your chile when you got stabbed. No, my lady's gonna look at your fucking chile. She's yeah. like, yo, this guy came yeah. in. He's a warrior. He was stabbed, bro. <laughs> bro. Bien but, but, but I wish he stabbed me with all that, with all that knife. <laughs> You don't want your girl being a nurse, dog. No, but look, okay. you don't want your girl being a nurse. She's out there looking at random ass Chile Most for no girls reason. Most get a nurse job. Most girls always get a nurse job. They go to college or whatever that little they quick go course. To that that little, quick course, bro. Those are nice. No, dude, don't 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 disrespect the nurses out there. No offense, <laughs> out to you nurses. If you ever catch me in the emergency room, <laughs> if I'm ever done, you yeah. forget that I had your back. All right. Is it? If you, don't, ever you don't even fucking his chlamydia. You don't even <laughs> fix his chlamydia. All right. <laughs> If FG is ever overdosing in there, please take care of him. Please take care of him. It's just ketamine or coke, one of the two. He's not on heroin. I tested my shit, so it definitely is fentanyl. <laughs> All right, but okay. Clinic is a normal job bitches get, and it pays good, right? Or like, She's like, I want to be a nurse. And you're like, all right. But you already know that there's going to be some guys working there that are male nurses. And you know that fool only got the holla for the bitches. You think so? You don't Duh. think there's some male out there's some male nurse out there just trying to save a life? Yeah, he's trying, trying to change he's a trying diaper. To, he's trying to take a life. <laughs> he's trying to your stab. girlfriend's pussy. <laughs> Watch out with these male nurses. But would he let her get no, a no, job? No. no, no, no. Here's what you don't get. This is where you're fucked up. Nurses do cheat a lot. It's known facts. But not with other male nurses. They cheat with the fucking doctors. They're not stupid oh, ass yeah, bitches. Yeah. They, dude, you're not. Come on, I'm gonna messing with the el mero mero. The doctor, I want. I, I don't want to keep living as a nurse. <laughs> These bitches want the orthopedic. So, so nurses, I ain't going for nurse. Dick. They, 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 want, they, they want. They want. They want the x ray logilist. I don't even know if that's a word, but whoever does the X rays. <laughs> x ray logilist. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> they want the orthopedic. They don't want the fucking other nurse, bro. All right, but let, let's. Okay, your girl's not super bomb. Where the even a doctor's gonna risk his marriage over this bitch. Even though a doctor do risk, do risk Dude, it, but they, well, they don't give a fuck. Come they on, they love the whole fucking crazy shit. Yeah, bro. There's no All cameras. Right, but your they, they, they know, they know where there's no cameras. <laughs> 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 or he knows where the camera's at and he's selling the footage. <laughs> but do, Doctor OnlyFans. <laughs> but, <laughs> All right, so your chick looks normal. But, okay, what kind of scenario should we put her in then? Cause, okay, not a nurse then, because you say that this bitch has the option of going to the doctor and she's going to ignore the male nurse. Okay, like, like, we're, like, we're like, like, Verizon Wireless? She's working no, at the phone no, store? No, no, definitely can't work at Verizon yeah, Wireless. You, no, it, no, this bitch going to get a new number. Now she's going to have a side phone. <laughs> now she's going to be cheating on you. Do not let your work as Verizon at T-Mobile. She knows all the ins and outs. If he could sell you a, a one-year plan, for sure he could sell you some dick. Yeah. So he's going to be flirting with your girl. No. Like, your girl, sign dude, up for this let, plan. Yeah, don't let month. your girl be a nurse. Don't let your girl work at Verizon as a fucking mobile tech person. Where, where would you let her work then? Lash tech. 100%. No, you can't. She can't be a, a last tech is a, a, a hairstylist. A hairstylist, but not a barber. A hairstylist, but not a barber. No, you're not, fucking, you're you're not giving you're the homies to, face. You're not giving the fucking homies face. You're babe. going. You're going to girl spot for a girl. We have to be with the. She's not gonna cheat on you with the customer. She's gonna cheat on you at work. A work hubby. You know how the girls be having work hubbies, bro. I worked at a factory. All these women were married and they had a work hubby there. 
Like, they were just fucking cuernuda. So, it's like, you're setting up a situation where, like, uh, nail tech. Oh, fucking. Yeah, that's, that's why when your lady comes up. That's, that's, that's why when your lady. That's why your lady comes up. You're like, hey, babe, looking for a job. You you guide her into jobs where she don't fucking cheat on you, dog. Like, oh, what do you want? Oh, well, lash tech. Yeah, I'll, I'll pay for the schooling. Oh, we have a room out there. You can fucking but put lashes that, on your homegirls. Uh, uh, she's not that smart. She's just a pendeja. Where would he let this pendeja She's a pendeja, then she, don't ha she shouldn't be working. <laughs> she's a pendeja, she shouldn't be working, homie. She's stupid. Like, just fucking, just fucking. What are you talking about? She's a pendeja. Like, she's well, not she a don't know she's a pendeja. <laughs> but you know she's a pendeja. And you know that bitch can't sell a phone as she needed to. You know she can't sell a 12 month plan. You send her to Herbalife. This bitch started selling Herbalife. <laughs> <laughs> so she's always home still. She's always home selling. Paul, send her over here. She can make reels for scum and cake. <laughs> nah. She started working here. She getting fucked. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> she gonna start making reels. Start making OnlyFans reels. <laughs> nah. So you wouldn't. Now nah, you gotta put in a. In a what, well, okay. Well, what about a waitress? That's a real. Uh, that's a real. Okay. That's okay. a real, real job that a lot oh, of people grab. Would okay. Your lady, be, would you let your lady be a waitress? I'll let my lady do anything, but I, I, I'm gonna be paranoid that she's gonna meet another waiter. That's serving up some See, other, some other kind of food. See, this is where you're fucking up. This is where you're fucking up, dude. If she's a waiter, if she's a waitress, she's not trying to fuck the other waiter. She's trying to take her ring off and flirt with the guy that just dropped a hundred thousand dollars. No, no, I'm just kidding. It's a restaurant. Shut up. Like, uh, she's, if she's working at Denny's, bro, you can't over here think, thinking that she's working at... Damn, dude, you, if you're you, a baller... You haven't been at this restaurant for okay, so uh, long, I don't even know what to call it no more. Katana. katana. Yeah, bro. If ever heard the Raptor, I haven't seen your Katanas, bro. Well, that Katana, ha has Katana hasn't seen me at Katana. <laughs> <laughs> Katana calls me. Well, I don't even do takeout. Should, ca should we cancel your membership? <laughs> All right, so she works at Denny's, bro. Okay, she she's starting off, bro, at a normal job. She's working at Denny's. There's a chef right there. That, you know he's not a real chef, but that fool just got the job like six months ago, and he can make pancakes. But he's a youngster. Are they fluffy? Are they fucking? Are they fluffy, the pancakes? Oh, I thought he said he's a fluffer, so he's fluffing her up for you before you get home. No. <laughs> for all the pancakes, I'm not fucking eating there. That's important. I'm, I'm gonna go. Oh, boy, you fluff, you fluff the pancakes very good. I don't mind you fluff my bitch too. What the fuck? That's important, dog. <laughs> Is the hash brown not burn? <laughs> ah, fuck it. Echale, echale pito, wey. Yeah, fool. She's a waitress, okay. And then the fucking cook, and then what? Is she at risk of getting taken taken out by? No, bro. If, but if, if, if you, you don't have a good bro, job, you bro. can't be XG. You're a bro, a normal bro, guy I pull working. It, I pull. Dude, dude, I'm not competing with no fucking sh fucking chef at he Denny's. He could compare better than you. All you do is make his pop tart. Bro, he's driving a fucking Honda Civic, bro. If I you were too to you raffle. Yeah, it? that's why now I'm not getting cheated on by no fucking <laughs> chef at Denny's, dog. If my lady comes up that she cheated on me on a chef with Denny's, dog, I'm fucking pissed. Back then in the Honda Civic, I'm like, damn, that's what I get. <laughs> now, <laughs> hell no, bitch. The fuck, I deserve better. Like cheat on me, yeah. Cheat on me with the guy with the Maserati, a Porsche. Don't make me feel like a fucking loser. This fool works at Denny's, He's making omelets. That's all he does for a living. So, but do you think that girls be getting like work cubbies? That's what I'm trying to get to the point of. Is it? Because a bitch is gonna go. Okay, she's been a stay. She's been a stay home girlfriend for six months. She hasn't seen no other guys. Maybe on on Instagram. But now she's in a situation where she's eight hours a day in a spot with some guy. You know that was cracking jokes. You know the guys in the, in the holiday, they, they be cracking jokes. Now so, what? so all I'm getting from this is if you have a girlfriend. She's cheating. Basically, I'm saying all I'm getting <laughs> from this is if you have a girlfriend and your girlfriend wants a job, she's basically cheating on it. Yeah. Either this bitch stays she, at she's home or to cheat on you. either she be better she stays at home or according to scumbag. That's what I, I wouldn't know what to do. Bro, I you, might leave her at home. You'd be a good Muslim, bro. Your wife just stays at home. She wears a hajib. She don't let. She don't get to go out. God uh, forbid she wants to fucking have a job. Are, are they hiring? <laughs> are they gonna holler? Yeah, but bro, if you're gonna put her. You're gonna put her out in the wild. In the wild, in the wild, in the workforce, dog. She's trying to get money, bro. She's trying to fucking better her life, and you're acting like you just put her out on the blade on fucking Figueroa, dog. Well, you are. Come on, it bro. It is the blade. It is what? the blade. Am I sitting next to somehow like part two Andrew Tate upgraded? Like, what is this? This one just said, oh, bro, she wants a job. She just wants to be in the wild. She's fertile. 
She's feral. No, you're not. Play, you better be like, don't you? She's a wild cat. Hey, these, they, <laughs> the these, fuck are you talking about? These bills are getting expensive. I gotta put her in the wild. Am I gonna risk it? Am I in the danger of getting divorced right now? Because well, you better that, neuter this bitch at this point. <laughs> well, I'm not gonna stop her from you fucking having sex. fucking a flea collar on her. What do you mean? If She's you neuter her, her if you neuter her, then fools are gonna come all up in her. She's gonna be like, oh, don't worry, I'm. I'd rather I, that. I'd rather that. If my girl's gonna be a major ass fucking skonka slut, she's not be a skonka. She's gonna be a waitress, not a skonka. <laughs> the bitch in the better be a skonka. I'm just saying though, but you know, she's a, a waitress. But you know how you just said, if your girl's out there being a slut, don't neuter her. You definitely want to neuter her. You don't want to fucking if someone else gets her pregnant. Now you got to take care of a kid that you think is yours. No, because you take the DNA test and you can find out she cheated a year later. But if she's neutered, you'll never know that you oh, that she cheated oh, dude, on dude. you. You'll never find out. You'll never find out. This is a serious question. The- this is a serious question, scumbag. <laughs> this is a serious 100% question. If you had a baby with a female, how many times are you getting D- are you are you getting the DNA test on that little motherfucker? So that was 18. How many of them? You would believe the one test. One every year. One every year. <laughs> Making sure that that kid hasn't been replaced with another kid. Like, did she switch? Every year I need a DNA <laughs> test on this little bull. <laughs> did she switch the baby? <laughs> like, damn. Put on the... He don't know the same how he did last year. I thought you were gonna Hey, this was getting a little taller. Are you sure it's my baby? <laughs> this was growing... Hey, the, at 16, this fool has a mustache. What's up with this fool? This fool says, I love you. Is he mine? <laughs> <laughs> I never trained him to talk like that. <laughs> With a simp. So you get your girl neutered? <laughs> get your girl neutered? <laughs> you mean tie her tubes, dog? You mean tie her tubes, dog? Man, bro, what is this today? Hey, she works at Hooters, but she's neutered. <laughs> Hootie hoo! Hootie hoo! Hootie whose kid is this? Hootie <laughs> Hoodie who? Oh, who, whose baby is it? Yours? Man, oh, see? Bro. I would I wouldn't let a girl. If I'm working. Nah, I would let her work because fuck that. She gotta pay some bills too, but See, I, you're I, so contradicting. You don't you're actually you want her to work, no, but I'm then gonna let her you work, don't want but her to work. I'm already gonna be knowing that she's cheating, so I'm gonna cheat. I'm cheating. Once once she gets hired for the job, I'm cheating all that right, same day. Right. Is there a job where she would have that you would never cheat? We're like, oh no way, my girl ain't cheating. She fucking she working at the nail salon, fool. Like, eh, like no dick there. Eka, Eka is there getting, a job where you'd be all right where you're going to, going to go work every day and she's like, oh babe, I gotta do overtime. You're like, oh yeah, that bitch gonna do an overtime. Yeah, she started working as my maid. <laughs> she could cheat on she could cheat on me with me. <laughs> hey, that's a good answer. I didn't even mess. That's a fucking great answer. It's a great answer. <laughs> Only cock at work is the cock that I'm supplying, bitch. Hey, bitch, don't be late. <laughs> <laughs> On your rag, either. <laughs> well, she's neutered. Why do you care? <laughs> no, I can't neuter her at when she's working for me. Well, then, well, that's crazy. I wonder if any fool has told some bitch, like, bitch, you got to gotta tie them tubes. You, you want to get a holiday? You got to get neutered? Damn. Damn. Imagine, but you, I can't trust a bitch that's neutered, bro. Because I've been the girls be hitting me up, they have boyfriends, and but like, why can't you touch the bitch that's neutered? Why do you? No, they be because tell- the bitches be telling me like, look, I have a boyfriend. Well, I said they have a boyfriend, whatever. They're on their pay with a boyfriend, but they're like, come and fuck me. I want you to fuck me, raw and nutting me. Don't worry, I'm neutered. And I'm like, damn, this bitch is talking like this, and she got a man. So you got, you can't neuter them because then you'll never find out where you're getting cheated on, bro. A bitch that's neutered will so risk wait, it the all. The only way to find out is if she gets pregnant. You're crazy, Nick. Well, well, how you're, else are you gonna you're find out? Fucking crazy. How else are you gonna find out? Looking through her phone. <laughs> <laughs> she gonna at erase the point, message. At that point, look through her phone, bro. <laughs> she gonna erase the messages. You swear, you gonna find some shit. That way, don't you, neuter okay, your bitch. Don't you be- neuter your bitch. At that point, you. At that point, you better. You better hope she blocked the. She fucked the black dude. Cause how you gonna know it's not yours, dog? Like this thing comes out with little blonde tips. You gonna DNA that old motherfucker? If he comes out black, right, what right. the hell? Here's a better I'm super, question. I'm super pale as I'm fucking pale as fuck, bro. What the fuck? No, that's what I'm saying. When when are you gonna know the DNA DNA test him? Unless he comes out black. If he comes out a little light skinned like me, I'm gonna be like, it's probably mine. Oh, uh, cause then you know what girls tell him. If I got, D- if you're gonna make me take a DNA test, I'm gonna tell him that you made me take a DNA test. Females play that card, and your son don't want to know that you didn't think it was you or his. I don't give a fuck what that little moral thing. <laughs> Stupid ass junior, what do you want me to? Be? I'm gonna waste my time, junior. Either you're my junior or not my junior. 
Junior. <laughs> Fuck out of here. Hey, girl, why'd you take a DNA test? I'm not an idiot. Here, even if I'm not. We're talking about juniors. We're talking about juniors. You heard what happened with uh, Tyrese Gibson, bro? He went to jail because he owes. When you say Tyrese Gibson, I think Tyrese Biggums. No, not not the Dave Chappelle. Not the Dave Chappelle. Tyrese Gibson, the guy from Fast and the Furious, the black baby boy. Yeah, baby boy. Baby boy. Fool. That fool couldn't pay child support. Think about it. Baby boy couldn't pay child support. Fifty Cent couldn't either. He didn't pay child support. He, he was saying he was broke. Remember, 50 Cent was saying he was broke. All right, all right. Well, that's not what I was getting to. What I was getting to is fucking Ty- Tyson Gibson went to jail for own child support. He was 75000 Do you think there's a limit where, like, a girl shouldn't get more than so-and-so for this kid? Or you think there's a cap? Like, I don't care if you're Elon Musk. I don't care if you're Kanye West. You know, a kid don't need more than ten grand a month. Like th- ten grand a month, a lot. And what there, if, there's kids there's, there, there's, there's dude, dude okay for yeah. young or what bro there's kids that are getting there's Katana baby, ma- baby? There's baby mamas that are getting more than 10 grand a month per kid i know but that's that, what i mean what's the cap what at one point if you were a judge 700 dollars bro these fools don't want to eat at the taco stand what every what do you day, mean dog. there's cho- taco wednesdays they're 50 cents on wednesday bro this fool should be fine come with- on bro these are your kids at the end of the day these are kids all right right i'm not saying they gotta eat filet mignon every day but they also don't gotta eat from the taco stand they don't eat a couple noodles. Shit, the taco stand probably right, makes better food than the mom. Okay, okay. Ten grand's too much. Seven hundred's too little, in my opinion. Is there a middle, dog? Is there a middle? Can we can we ask uh, for more money? Month? Can we ask more money for a scumbag? Can we ask a little bit more money for a scumbag? Well, <laughs> what's our extra T-shirt a week? Three racks a month. Three racks a month. Do you think that's cap? Like no, that's cap. You don't need more. Than, you don't need more than that. I, I kind of agree. Now I gotta pay for that rent work. too. That bitch should work. That bitch should work. So she makes what two grand? And find your hubby at work so he could pay the bills. Well, both yeah. pay the bills. What's your, yeah, go get a side fool. <laughs> <laughs> go get a side fool. Let that fool help out with the bills. <laughs> but you think three caps the most on the real though? Well, ten grand is a lot to give a fucking a one k. Like, what is this for? Like, and at that point, I'm like, at that point, I better take them shopping every day. Yeah. See, because the girls will keep, keep the money. Like, they okay, do. give me five thousand a month on child support, and the bitch has a, a Gucci bag. The bitch don't even work. She got a Gucci bag. She got new shoes. She got all the Jordans. She had a Don Kennedy show <laughs> with a seventy dollar t shirt. She got a chili shirt for thirty dollars. Thirty dollars a shirt at Chili Dop Shop. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no, nah, these bitches be taking advantage of that shit. Like <sighs> three racks a month. How much is that a week? What's uh, that's six hundred a week? There's a whole paycheck. A whole forty hours of work for no work for taking care of Junior when all he did was give him hot Cheetos. Three uh, racks. Oh, uh, uh, he was all cheating. So the most off? you would ever pay is three racks before you like, you you leave the country. If the if the, if the lawyer said, "Yo, scumbags, you making this much amount? Whoopty whoopty whoop! I need you to give five racks to your OnlyFans wife." You you're leaving Mexico? You're out of here. Um, Bye, I'm bitch. Out of here. What the fuck? I'm out of here. Ain't no way you getting at five that racks point, out of I'm, me. I'm gonna need somebody to pay child support for me. <laughs> the fuck? I better I better not the mama. I'm no, gonna, I'm, I'm, not gonna lie, to, like, I'm gonna turn to a baby. I'm not. A, I, I don't think seven hundred is enough. I think maybe around three grand. I think three grand, two grand, if you have it. A if mu- you have a, it. A if month. you have it. Yeah. Well, I'm a, talking like you're like top notch. You're like a millionaire. Elon three racks should be enough. If you want to give more, if you want to give more, you're a good dad. So it should be the same bro, for everybody. If you're poor or rich, three thousand is the most. I think it should be a cap. And the least should be like what? A thousand. A thousand if you're if you're, if you're a normal guy. If you got thousand. it, if you got it. Obviously, if you don't got it, that's, that's 250 different. a week for your kid. That's what you would waste if you took care of him anyways, right? 250. But you know what? Instead of the child support, you should use the child su- support should come in like food stamps. Like here's 250, but in only things you could buy food with. Cause then that bitch is using that 250 for a Gucci bag and buying other shit she don't need. Like fuck that. Taking other fools on dates, bro. Yeah, I've I been ha- there. I've had that. I've been there. I've had I had a bomb ass dinner at SDK. Uh, all right, um, alimony money, bro. Uh, tastes it so great. Let's raise it to five thousand because we gotta eat. Hmm? We gotta eat, so raise up the child support to five thousand. <laughs> <laughs> it felt great though. It felt great when she paid for the tab. There you go. See, it's better like that. But then you, I felt bad though. That was the kid's money, bro. When she paid for my dinner, I was like, oh, low key, that should be a kid's like a kid's meal. Like this isn't this is money. This isn't meant for me. The dad didn't work. Like this is it. You get what I mean? It's not for you, dog. You eat, you eating off that is not, it's for the bebitos, it's for the niños, dude. You gotta, you gotta, you can't be like a scum. We are scumbags, but like, you know, it's well, for fun, the bebitos. Fun. He can eat chicken nuggets. 
You're eating filet mignon It's for eating chicken nuggets uh, He doesn't want filet mignon He wants nuggets You're right These little stupid ass kids That's all I want, want nuggets I want happy you meal fucking get he, he not saying, I want filet mignon What the fuck <laughs> All right, guys, we got to cut this episode short. I got to go to the Dodger game. They're already outside for me. But follow our Instagrams at Scumbags. Follow XG's Instagram. FullyToxic.com, my blog. Uh, Heart Summer blog just came out. It was dope. Go check it out. Uh, Chili Mini Dop Shop for this t-shirt. And uh, go Dodgers, I guess. Go Dodgers. <laughs> check, out the new, check out the new Coyote blog. We just dropped on Sunday. And this Saturday, Coyote is performing at the Regent Woo-hoo. right here in DTLA. Hit me up for tickets. They're 20 bucks if you hit me up. Or hit up Coyote, say that I sent you. $20, 30 at the door. Well, I'll we're, be there. Don't get mad if I don't show up like I usually don't. We're going to vlog, and even if he don't show up, he's fired. <laughs> uh, but I'm going to be there for sure. So go. They're going to be a vlog about it, so I hope you guys enjoy it. We'll see you guys. I really got to go, guys. They're outside waiting for me. I'm bullshitting on the podcast. Hey, look, guys. I'm bullshitting. They're waiting for me outside, but fuck it. Lates. Cheers.